Cut. Got an abandoned vehicle report at the church here. Is that it over there? Or is that a flower bed? I can never tell. Two five three star A supervisor. Mm -hmm. As soon as we get a green light, we'll go check it out. I think I can turn left here? We'll find out. I swear to god locals, it is downtown. Da, 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 da. I don't see a bike here. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, the owner will not leave the premises. Oh. Let's go find him. I thought it was just a abandoned bike. 253 286. Go. Uh, found the shoes. Let's see what his bike is, shall we? I found the shoes. Watch for. Where is it? Why is Baker getting fired? I don't even want to know. Oh, there's the AI dog that sits at the gravesite. That's one of the things that happens around here, one of the local spawning kind of events. That was a flower bed, okay. I was just wrong. I don't know where this is. Yeah, that dog always sits at that gross site and there's always a bunch of flowers there. It's kind of sad. Rockstar does some really kind of sad moments in this game sometimes. Well, this looks like a person. 27843. I'm over by the back corner, uh, behind the pond. Got one here. So, are you okay? Oh, Alex! Oh. Hey. Holy crap. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm... I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah. You don't look fine. What's... What's going on? What's wrong? The pastor said you've been here for a few days. The hell's got into you? Wonder who this is. Oh. Oh. I see. Uh, you want to talk about it? Uh, I don't even know how to go about this. They were your family, right? <laughs> These, yeah, this is what's left of them, yeah. <sighs> Sorry, they, Alex. It, I, I'm just like, I don't understand. Yeah, 27843, it's Alex Sanchez. Um, he's 10 4, but if you still want to come over here, please do. Copy. Uh, confirm he's you said me. back yeah. corner by the pond. Yeah. Or so, what's prompted this? Yeah. Um. Three days, really? What's going on with you? I don't know if I can keep doing the sentence. Yes, you can. can You've can. gone so no. far, you pushed so no, hard. No, no, no. It's, it's not about that. What is it about, then? Anytime I have somebody close, anytime I try to get out of my zone, anytime I try to do anything, Somebody I know always gets Call one, two, eight, six. I heard about the hospital. Always. You okay? It's one hell of a way to wake I'm, up. 
No. I I don't know why I woke up. I don't know how I woke up. So it seemed like the right time. Clearly means you're meant for more than this, Alex. <laughs> you're the only person I know who has woken up out of a coma and taken down gangbangers. It's pretty impressive. I didn't want to wake up. No, if I'd had your experiences, I don't think I would either, but you did, and so you are. And I don't know why I'm going through this tournament. I don't know why. I can't hold anything together. I'm falling apart. I've yet to go home still. I, I, I can't keep doing this. The day in, day out, just the constant demons that are going through my head I, I can't I've lost it all the more people I get close to the more I keep glancing back at this job and for what all for this to end up in a stone well you're gonna end up in a stone regardless me. And for me to just keep going on and on. Look, you can look at it that I way, Alex, if you want to, but no matter what happens, no matter what we do with our lives, whether you were to stay inside your home and never leave, or if you were to end it today, or if you were to put your life to a great purpose helping other people, no matter what you do, we're all going to end up lying under a stone. Every single one of us, no matter what path we take, this is the one thing we all share. One day we will all die. But it's what we it's not the do point, Abs. while we're there that makes a difference. No. They ended up... They ended up in a barrel. <sighs> because of me. I stormed a stupid boat to take down people that were causing her, causing harm. And I open up stupid barrels on a damn scene and find them all grounded up in a stupid oh, barrel. God, I'm sorry. I can't keep doing this. It's every, any time I get close to anybody. Any time. Well, what's happened no matter to how hard recently? I try. Huh? What's brought this on? It's the fact that I don't want to wake up and I still... Woke up. Yeah. It's a and side effect of being alive. Why. And I don't know why I keep waking up. Uh. I want to go. I want to see them again, and I can't. You will one day. I know you will. One day, you'll join them in heaven, and you'll be together forever. But the amount of times you survived crazy, horrible things since I've known you, Alex, the more it tells me that the Lord's got a plan for you. Your work isn't done yet. Because you've survived more things than I could possibly hope to in my life. And the fact you've managed to get up and keep going after your family passed and the amount of times you've been hurt and shot and suffered... The fact you've gotten up again and kept going. The fact your heart keeps beating. He has a plan for you. And it's clearly not done yet. It's the reason we're all alive. I don't know if you're that religious, but I have faith. And it helps me when I feel dark. It tells me there's a reason. We don't always know what that reason is. Hell, if, if we knew what the reason was, it wouldn't be called faith, it'd be called fact. But I believe I'm I here for something. So are you. I don't you. know what to do anymore. I don't. I'm so lost and I can't do anything. I can't do anything. I can't. It, it hurts. It hurts. I know. It's okay, honey, I know it is. I know it hurts. It... I 
can't do anything much. You're okay. I don't want I can't do it. I don't know what to do anymore. It sucks. It sucks and I don't know what to do. I feel scared to do anything. To move on, to do anything else before. It feels like it just taps me back. I don't know. You know, you had some good impacts to this world, right? I was ready to up and quit when I started this job. Okay. I was. It was only you that kept me going. You're the only reason I'm still alive now. You know the horrible things I've been through? I survived them because of you. There are other cops out there and there are citizens out there who are alive because of you. It's the things you've done that have given other people a chance. Okay? Pretty sure you saved the LT's life as well before. You've done good, Alex. You might not see it, but you have. You gave me hope when I had none. I mean, it's our turn to do the same for you when you don't. But we're here, okay? I can't begin to imagine what you've been through, but... The world needs you. I need you. We all need you. It's not your time, clearly. Don't think like this. Dwelling in the darkness isn't good for anybody. You're one of the strongest people I know. I, I'm pretty sure if I'd been through half of what you've been through, my, I'd be crushed. I wouldn't even be here. But you, you're still standing. I don't know how you do it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. You're a good man, Alex, okay? Don't let us defeat you. Okay. I promise. Yeah. Okay. Also, where the hell's the nearest coffee shop or something, LT? This guy needs something um, to eat. Badly. I would assume there's something down on the boardwalk, but... Probably. The only decent one I know of is the Crucial Fix. That's a bit of ways away. There's there's one over there off Magellan. It's not too far. True. Come on, you come in with us. I'm not taking no for an answer. Okay. Come on. Do you want us to tell the pastor Thank we'll you. come and get his bike later? He doesn't yeah. be too worried. I'll meet you down on the boardwalk, right, LT? Yep. Come on. This is... <laughs> I know my mum always used to say it, but you'll feel better after something to eat and something to drink. Three days sitting in the graveyard. <laughs> I didn't even know I could spend a night there. Never mind, three days. It's all the old training, that's all. Oh, yeah, you get to sit in the graveyard for days on end. Sure. Just not eating. <laughs> Depression will do that to you. You need to see somebody. Really. Then again, I think if you saw a therapist, you'd probably drive them insane. And I, I, I can't tell you how much I am appreciative of this. 
Uh huh. Well, you'd have done this for me, so get in. Go on. Mm. You taught me when I had no hope. If I have to mother you for a while, then that's fine. <laughs> you don't have to. Oh, I do. But... Oh, I absolutely do. <laughs> now, I'm not saying it's going to be Hope, cu hope Cuisine. It's not. It's going to be a hot dog and a soda, but it's going to be something in your system. Okay? Alright. I'll take you up on that. You, are, you have no choice. There is no choice in this uh -huh. matter. There is literally no choice. I will force feed you if I have to. Alright. I'll get a ticket that for I, I, I got the message. Uh huh. Yeah, you better had. Uh huh. So the rookie. The LT has will order you to if you have huh? to. <laughs> Not quite. Yeah. I still need your tutelage <laughs> sometimes. But if you don't mind, I'm not going to take your advice about sitting in graveyards and moping. Uh, no, I don't trust you to. I'd be too I don't scared. I you'll be able to last it through the day. Nope. Couldn't. <laughs> That's the red light. I didn't see it. I did. I was too busy looking at the road. Mm -hmm. Look, you're still around, which means there is a plan for you, okay? I'm not some crazy, you know, god bother or anything, but I have faith, okay? And that faith gives me comfort when I need it. It's important to me, and I know that we are there for a reason. What that reason is, I don't know. Does it mean we have preordained destiny? No, I don't think I so. But we are still we are around for a wider purpose, whatever that purpose may be. And everyone's purpose is different. Alex, yours is to help people. That much I know. And you've clearly not helped enough people yet because you're still around. Hmm. It's like quantum leap. Maybe you'll blink off to the next reality when you've done your the task you came here for, you know? Yeah. I could see you being Sam from Quantum Leap. Don't tempt to walk him into the office once I'm free and be exactly like that. Oh yeah. Just don't go body hopping as well, you know? Nah, nah I'm good. I'll stick to my own body. Especially in this state, I don't trust anybody. Uh huh. Alright, this guy's... More than fine. In fact, we'll go to be a machine. Come on. Two seven eight four three. Beam machine on the on the boardwalk. Yep. Come on, you get up a chair. I'll be back in a second. I don't know if we can sit down here, but we'll try. I want the seat script back. Clear options. I'd love to be able to sit down if this works. It'd be great. If it doesn't, I, I get it. I'm totally on board with it not working. Yeah, that doesn't work. Well, I didn't really want to sit down anyway. I, uh, oh, I, I can't see. Close it's enough. Fun. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, there's the LT now. Here. Yeah. Eat. Now. It's an order. Mm hmm. Hey, LT. Hey. He's very sorry and he won't do it again. Thanks, LT, for sticking by and coming out. I appreciate it. Yeah, well, he was more yeah, bothered when you realized who it was. You look awful. You're showering a yeah. shave and some fresh clothes. I feel awful. You look homeless. Well, I haven't been home since I got out of the hospital. You're crazy! Away from... That was last week! I know. 
and I got a hotel and been staying there for a little bit. I <sighs> sitting in that bed just does something to you. Oh, I can imagine, but it doesn't mean you have to stay up for another week after you just woke it up. Yeah, Does the sheriff okay. know where you are? I've been phone silent, period. I'm surprised the war party up. hasn't been dispatched already. Yeah, you might want to give her a call, man. You know she was there when your ass woke up, right? She was visited you as much as I did. Kind of remember it. It's still all foggy. She kicked the crap out of a Diablo's guy in front of your hospital room whilst they were taking the whole hospital over. By the way, that bitch was a badass. <laughs> it doesn't seem to surprise me still to this day. He had a double barrel shotgun. There were like five or six SWAT officers and patrol cops facing off. Dude drops his shotgun and she threw down. I bet she did. She's and then you woke up. A tough son of a bitch. You woke up and capped the other one out of your goddamn coma. I, I don't know how you do it. I so, uh, don't know either. I, I woke up, you know, kind of remember something, hit the ground again, came up, couldn't breathe, and after that I was out. I, it's hard to remember anything. A couple more surgeries from what I'm told. Yeah. God, I... That would be real generous of you, Mr. Rather... <laughs> You've got friends, okay? You aren't alone. You do have a reason to still be around. You have a reason to exist and to live. You've got us. You've got everybody else. If you weren't here, you'd leave a huge hole in our lives. Think of all the students you've taught. Think of all those rookie cops that know their way around a Glock now, thanks to you. You know, the people that don't immediately get shot in the street because you taught them how. Yeah. Look at all the mistakes I made before you taught me. Now I know better. I guess this old dog still has a little bit more fire than them, huh? You do, yeah. And I will tell you that every day if I have to. I appreciate both of you a lot, actually. Yeah. Probably have to it's face the music man. when I get home. But it'll be fine. You know I'm calling Rory, right? Huh? I'm calling Rory, right? You know that, right? I'm calling him or not? I'm calling him. I'm going to tell him oh, you're coming I've... home. Yeah. After oh, I take you that's... home. I... I'm fully aware of that. Uh-huh. I just have to turn on my phone. Can't wait for that. Uh -huh. 6,000 text messages, 6,000 phone calls, and probably a threaten from, you know, our boss saying, hey, where the hell are you, you know? I am surprised SWAT and the helicopters haven't been out looking for you. I'm surprised either, but I, <sighs> I appreciate that. Thank you for the sandwich and stuff. Yeah. I'm going to take you home, and I'm going to come around later and make sure you've had dinner as well. Okay. Yeah. You need you need looking after it until that flamboyant bastard helps you. I will. As long as he doesn't try to bathe me, I think we're okay. I think you'll be okay, but he might put on a frilly apron. I'm just... just no, nah, because at that point then I'm moving <laughs> out. <laughs> I, I, I would be chances. surprised if he hasn't been vacuuming your your apartment with the frilly apron on already. Yeah, it wouldn't surprise me. I'm just picturing a Queen video. Yeah, that's pretty oh, accurate. No. <laughs> Come on, I'm gonna take you home. You're still up in the hills, right? Uh, no, I'm in a. Apartment, actually. I thought you were living with Rory at his place, no? No, Rory's living with me. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, make sure get him off. yeah. Yeah, you'll need these back. The LT swipe off of you. Alright, here's your gun and badge back. Uh, 
think so too. Appreciate yeah, just it. Looking out for you. Yeah, it's no problem, man. Yeah, you take care of yourself now. Oh, well, do. Well, I'll see you around. Don't worry. Come on. You're free, man. I don't want to see you like that ever again. You got it, LT. Right, where is this place that I apparently haven't been to yet? Oh, it's Rory's old place that was in the hills. Never mind. I got confused. Hey there. Hey. Just direct me. Yeah, it's over off Integrity Way. It's a uh, that apartment building that's right across the street from the um, construction yard over there. About three nine. Uh, oh, got another one. Yeah. Oh god, Alter, uh, another one. <sighs> Look, you're ever in this sort of position again, call me. Or call someone. Call Rory, call the sheriff. Call anyone, okay? You shouldn't be alone like that. You don't deserve to be alone like that. The amount you've given to other people, you, you deserve us, okay? You deserve us. You absolutely deserve us. You hear me? I do. And we will come when you just... need us. Yeah. I think it's just... I'm so used to giving and not... Receiving not accepting. back. Yeah. Just... We'll get used to it. It's weird. What are these idiots doing here? I think it's some sort of visible <laughs> style. Yeah, it's some fun to be. No. You deserve everything you, you get, okay? And I will not hear anything of it. And you will get fit and you will get back to work. Okay? I will take you running. Yeah. I promise. You even have to come to this stinky metropolis every single day. You will go running. We'll do yoga, we'll get you back to fitness. You'll be back on the job in no time. Whole new classes of rookies to take on. Oh yeah. Someone's gotta keep them alive. Who else uh -huh. is gonna do it? I've seen you, you got a good head on your shoulders there. Only because of you. Okay? Yeah. Only because of you. If it wasn't for you, I wouldn't. Map mistakes I remember making when I first started, it was awful. I was terrible. I turned my back on the suspects. I wasn't a very good driver. God, I remember the first time I had to use my service weapon. I nearly cried. You made me into the cop I am, okay? You're the reason I'm still alive. Because the amount of crazy in this city, I would be dead by now if it wasn't for you, okay? Remember that. Oh god, Yogi. No. No, is he? He's around, I'm putting my phone back down, and I am not paying any more attention to this. Right, as long as nobody sees me, I'll be fine. Yeah. I know Yogi likes you, so we're going to just avoid him. Huh? Please Yogi. So. I Crazy know. guy, please, funny please. hair. I, I remember, don't worry. Uh-huh. That part I do remember. Especially since the son of a bitch decided to stab me in the back as a hug. Yeah, he hugs people weirdly. With mm -hmm. knives. No, I, I... I can't even begin to express and say thank you for this. Hey, it, that's what friends are for, Alex. Duh. Yeah. You've, you've helped me out in you know, so more ways than you can think. Uh huh, and I always will. You're my friend, Alex. That's what friends do. You know, it's, it's funny. Even when you were marrying that crazy lady. But we won't talk about that. Yeah, we don't talk about that. No, we don't talk about Bruno. No, no, no. No. I will say, though, you definitely remind me a lot of a. of my first wife, though. A lot. <laughs> Well, just let me remind you of me. 
Mm, don't worry, you've got your own character. I'm just oh, saying. Oh, look, it's Wang doing nothing of... important. This is the one, right? Uh, no, that's no. It's no? three, two. It's down the street. Oh, ahead of us. Probably you turn and just keep going. Yeah, just ahead of us in that intersection. See, I know my way around the city now. I don't know. You're definitely better than here? what you first started. Take a left. Left here. Okay. <sighs> You're gonna be all right. Okay, you've got all of us. Just promise you'll talk to one of us before you do this again. Please? I promise. I won't, I won't go off on this. The next time I want to see you in a graveyard is in like 30, 40, 50 years when you're old and grey and you're finally in a box and you're off for the last time. I don't want to see you hanging around in graveyards again, okay? Alright, well then, if you're making that promise to me, promise me I won't see you in any kind of graveyard or anything like that. And if I am, I'll be dressed in black with a lace veil and one of those parasols standing, Sorry, you know, subtly off in the distance while someone gets buried randomly just to make them think they knew someone important and secretive, okay? Uh-huh. It'll be fine. It'll be like a scene after Wednesday. Right. I'll call back here later, okay? Take it easy. Karma. I'll be back after my shift, okay? I'll have dinner ready. Yeah. Thank you. Go on. I got naps. Yeah. Go on inside. Well, I wasn't expecting that to be my day today. And I will definitely be posting this for you guys, as much as it was not an action video. That was deep as hell. I love Alex Sanchez's character. Isaiah's a great role player, and that was that was deep. That was some deep stuff. <laughs> Hopefully, people aren't crying and/or depressed. I know I am both. Um, but that was that was wild. That's not got a red light on this lane, so it's a perfect turn. See you guys around. Thank you for watching. Bye.